Keep it simple. Keep it simple. Dean Blanchard here with another video on how to shoot shotguns. Let's get going. Today's video, we have a simple target. Comes off of this machine right here in front of me to the left. It's a slow flying target. I see so many shooters making this target so much more difficult than it needs to be. Let's take a look at this target. Pull. Now we've seen the target. Let's break this down. It's very simple. I want to set my body up to where I want to break the target. I'm going to move back and forth till I find that nice spot where it feels the best. Also, on this target, to make it easy, I'm going to start the gun most of the way up. I'm going to look back at the machine and watch the target go up. The visual pickup point is what we're looking at for the target when we say pull. The hole point, if you notice, it's higher and a little bit right because the target's going up and to the right. So this way we can see the target before the gun and then we can move the gun with the target to the break point in a much easier way. Pull! Pull! Now that you've seen it over the shoulder with me holding up pretty high, let me show you what not to do. I see so many shooters do this. They hold near the machine. They swing way too fast. It's hard to control gun speed when you're coming from so far behind the target. Pull! Pull! It's so easy to shoot over top when you're coming from behind. This, why let this target beat you? It's a simple target. It's not going very fast. But I've seen this time and time again, even with competitive shooters, they're holding near the trap, they swing through the target real fast, and then they miss over top over and over again. Let's take a look at the shot cam footage on both those shots. The dot is where the gun is pointing, and I'm up higher. I can see the target come up. It's no surprise. My eyes are locking in on it. Now I can sync up the target and make it quite easy to break. This is a slow target. It doesn't take much to break it. Now we hold just over the machine, because I don't like holding at the machine at all. Now the target's going to come up, and it's going to pass the gun. Now I have to chase the target down, swing through it, and try to hit it, which takes a lot of timing to hit the target. You saw me holding at the machine and I had a lot of gun speed. When you have a lot of gun speed like that, basically you're trying to go bang and, and that's tough to do. It's hard to just swing fast and go to a slow moving object and stop. But if we watch it come up, bang, makes it a lot easier. We're not having to do all this fast movement. It's just watch it come up, slight move, break the target. Hope this video helps. Have a great day.